Willst du, bis der Tod euch scheidet, treu ihr sein für alle Tage? Willst du, bis der Tod euch scheidet, treu ihr sein für alle Tage? Du, du hast, du hast mich, du, du hast, du hast mich. Siempre fui un gran fan de Better Call Saul, y debo admitir que el personaje de Lalo me cautivó completamente. Меня зовут Василий Зайцев, и я считаю, что «Враг у ворот» — это лучший фильм американского кинематографа, когда-либо созданный. «Тен той ла, вес ва той туксу ратиш ан фо, мой ки трой муа, той джен куан фо, ган ха тен ла». So, Eleven Labs just announced dubbing. Automatic voice translation for your videos. And we're going to compare it to Hey Gen, another AI video and voice generation software that I have been playing around with that can produce video and voice from scratch. You just enter a script and it goes to work. But this is Eleven Labs, so let's try it out. Create new dub. We're going to call it uh, test one and we're going to translate from English to, let's see, well, let's start with French. I'm going to use one of my own videos here. Let's let's keep the watermark on. Why not? We'll just do the first 15 seconds here. All right, let's try that out. And while that's going, I'm going to keep trying with different languages. So let's do a German. So that's going to be my German sound. So right now it's going a little bit slowly. I think this is the first day that this was released. So currently it's taking about 20 seconds just to kind of like process this screen. And it looks like it took about 26 seconds to process 15 seconds of YouTube. All right, so let's try the French version first. Imaginez ça si vous ne pouvez pas vous réveiller le matin. Vous prenez votre café ou tout autre stimulant qui vous fait aller. Vous allumez votre ordinateur et apparaît votre propre agent AI autonome. Vous la tu nommé Goldie ou Gigi pour faire court. Nice sound good. What about German? Let's see. Stellen Sie sich das vor, wenn Sie morgens aufwachen, trinken Sie Ihren Kaffee oder was auch immer Ihnen sonst noch anregt. Sie schalten Ihren Computer ein und es erscheint Ihr eigener autonomer KI-Agent. Du hast ihn Gold genannt oder Gigi Kurz. Kurz. Das war sehr. When I said du hast there for a second, I thought I was about to break out into song. All right, so I've actually just uploaded this. So let's see if that might be better. And uh, let's try something a little bit more difficult. Let's try Chinese. I'm curious how I would sound in Chinese. That's a notoriously difficult language to speak, or I guess to learn to speak. And I'll do just one more and I'm going to end up doing all these, aren't I? There are too many good ones to try. All right, so that one's going to be Japanese. You know, I'm actually going to do medium because we really don't need, we're just testing this out. Yeah, let's go. Now, I'm curious if this is going to make people more interested in learning other languages because they're going to be like, oh, I sound really good in that language. Or it's going to completely stop any interest in learning any foreign languages. By the way, so this is the 11 labs where you can do, there's there's a lot of voices. For example, there's a voice library. So you can kind of go through and just let us always meet each other with smile for the smile is the beginning of love. Wow. So, you know, you can go through and kind of test each one out. We have committed the golden rule to memory. Let us now commit it to life. And you can also create your own voice with, you know, your your own recordings. I did this one. So this is the the free one that everybody has access to. This is how I sound. This is how I sound in 11 Labs. It's the cheap, free, and quick one. This is how I sound. So it, I don't know, man. I'm not hearing it. I don't think that sounds like me. Let's try to exaggerate the style a little bit, lower the stability. This is how I sound in 11 labs. It's the cheap, free, and quick one. It doesn't sound like me. And this one is the fine-tuned one. So you pay, I believe it's 50 bucks. And it takes a few days, but this is supposed to be the thing that sounds like you. This is how I sound in 11 labs. It's the premium, fine-tuned voice that takes a few days to process. I don't know. I don't hear it. I changed some of the options here. So let's do more variables. Sometimes when you get really low on this thing, just really bizarre crap happens as you get deep into this. I've had, I was testing out some, some female voices on there. And if you have it super low, every once in a while, they start like growling and sounds almost demonic. And then they start screaming. It's bizarre. So, you know, approach this with caution, I guess. This is how I sound in 11 labs. It's the premium fine-tuned voice that takes a few days to process. Anyways, I to all those people accusing me in the comments of trying to replace myself with an AI voice, I don't think I don't think we have the technology for that quite yet. So, and then Chinese. 想想一下,如果你早上醒来后喝咖啡或其他能刺激你的东西,你打开电脑,单出一个属于你自己的自主AI代理。那真的很, so I mean, that sounds good to me, certainly, but I, 
don't, don't speak Chinese, so I'm not sure, but certainly the specific tonal sounds seem very similar to, to what my ear hears when I hear people speaking Chinese. So I'm going to assume that's pretty good. Again, sounds good to me, but I don't know. All right. And finally, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to do a full one that is in Spanish. All right. So I'm going to do a full one in Spanish, high resolution, and let's see how long that takes. So it says, it, it tells you how many characters it's going to take 3000. I got to see how much you get per month or whatever. So I'll note the time and let's go. Let's see how long this takes. So this video is 22, almost 23 minutes. So I got to say, if it is able to do this under, let's say half an hour, so it's, you know, just maybe a little bit more than one to one. I mean, that'd be pretty incredible. But that means it's almost live translation, basically. And now while that's going on, let's compare the outputs with HeyGen. So HeyGen is, there's a wait list for it. I got in in about maybe a week and a half after I, I signed up for it. And you're able to just give them footage of yourself. And, you know, then it's able to produce that footage with any language, sounding like you, looking like you. So here's me in English. Transformers are a type of machine learning model mainly used in natural language processing, NLP tasks, like translating languages, summarizing texts, or answering questions. The name Transformer, so that's English, a little bit robotic, but pretty good. Here's me talking about how I learned to speak Spanish because I watched Better Call Saul and I really like the Lalo character. Hola, soy Wes Roth. Siempre fui un gran fan de Better Call Saul y debo admitir que el personaje de Lalo me cautivó completamente. Su carisma y forma de hablar me inspiraron tanto que decidí aprender español. So I've asked people how that sounds in Spanish and they said it was very good, very, a very good translation. Tentoy la so that's Vietnamese. I'm talking about how much I love a pho. Here's German. Willst du bis der Tod euch scheidet treu ihr sein für alle Tage? Willst du bis der Tod euch scheidet treu ihr sein für alle Tage? Nein. Nein. Du, du hast, du hast mich, du, du hast, du hast mich. It gets a little weird with that nine there, but, but yeah, that's Rammstein, Du Hast, an excellent, excellent song. This is their Russian translation. Меня зовут Василий Зайцев, и я считаю, что Враг у ворот – это лучший фильм американского кинематографа, когда-либо созданный. So this in Russian sounds perfect. It's very accurate, very well spoken. And so the Russian dubbing is ready on this one. Let's check it out. Представьте это. Если вы не можете проснуться утром, у вас есть кофе или что-то еще, что вас стимулирует. Иду. Включаю компьютер, и появляется твой собственный автономный агент. И ты назвал его Голди или Джиджи для краткости. Кратко. Это было очень. So that, I'm going to say, is not very good. The full Spanish one, surprisingly, so it's been about, I started this about five minutes ago. A little bit under five minutes ago, and it has, you know, five minutes, 47 seconds remaining. That's a 23-minute video. So that's much faster than one-to-one, -one, which is incredible. So that, that even means it sounds like you could stream something and have it translated. You know, not live. I mean, you would have to have a little bit of a delay probably, but, you know, let's say you have a 10-second delay, and then it'll be translated, you know, live after a 10-second delay or whatever, which is pretty cool, I got to say. So, I mean, you can have global live streams translated you know there was just a slight delay and now it's ready so it's even faster so it's been six minutes just under seven minutes to do a full video so let's take a look as por la mañana tomas tu café o cualquier otro estimulante que te impulse enciendes tu computadora y aparece tu propio agente de ia autónomo lo llamaste dorado ugg para abreviar Eso fue muy inteligente de tu parte. Gigi te informa lo que ha estado haciendo mientras dormías. Durmiendo ya ha estado muy ocupado. So, I don't know. To me, it doesn't sound quite good. Here's, here's the Hey Gen version to compare it to. Hola, soy Wes Roth. Siempre fui un gran fan de Better Call Saul y debo admitir que el personaje de Lalo me cautivó completamente. Su carisma y forma de hablar me inspiraron tanto que... Now, it's not a great one-to-one -one comparison because here... It's generating from scratch, whereas there it has to keep up with what I'm saying on the camera and kind of translate it live. So, and it has to, you know, it's not starting from zero. You know, if you need something that's fast and that translates something that's already existing, I think 11 Labs looks like it's going to be excellent for that. Anyways, what do you think? Is this something that's going to be useful? 
This feels pretty big. I feel like YouTube should quickly add this to as just an option, maybe even a paid option for their users. Imagine every video of every creator and every channel just being available in, you know, maybe not every language, but at least like the, let's say the five, the 10 most spoken ones. And so just really fast to give people an idea of like how varied the traffic to this channel is. So this is my channel. So you can see here, this is the United States. I am in the United States. It's only 36% of the traffic. I mean, it's the biggest one, but still, I mean, look at is so many countries represented here. It's a very long tail with just a lot of different countries. And I'm sure that some of the people listening might prefer it in their language. Maybe there's a lot of people that are not able to understand it fully because it's not in their language. So something like this seems like it could be really good. All right. So I hope you enjoyed that. If, if you want me to go deeper into stuff like this, you know, hit thumbs up. That signals to me that this is interesting. If you want to know more about 11 labs or Hey Jen, I can definitely do a deep dive and showcase all the other things that you can do with it. My name is Wes Roth. Thank you for watching.